A sensational discovery among the famous pyramids is currently making the rounds. Two scientists claim to have discovered an enormous underground city that is said to be 10 times larger than the pyramids themselves. What really lies behind these claims? Today we take a closer look at this controversy and clarify whether one of the greatest archaeological discoveries of all time is indeed hidden beneath the sands of Egypt. Be sure to stay until the end. Welcome everyone! Underground structures that extend for several kilometers, spiral passages and several floors deep. Sounds like something from an Indiana Jones movie, doesn't it? If you are as fascinated by the mysteries of our past as I am, then go ahead and subscribe. It doesn't cost anything, you'll never miss a video again, and you'll be helping me a lot. Thanks a lot, guys. So now off to the land of the pharaohs, more precisely to the Giza Plateau, the home of the most famous pyramids in the world. These gigantic stone monuments are not only the oldest, but also the only remaining of the seven wonders of the ancient world. Built over 4,500 years ago, they continue to fascinate researchers and tourists alike. And now two scientists claim to have made a truly incredible discovery that could overshadow everything we know about the pyramids so far. A secret city beneath the pyramids. Am I the only one getting mummy vibes from this? Get your ugly face off of her! Look what I got! Let me know if you've seen the movies and what you thought of them. In my opinion, they are still among the very best adventure films of all time. It's Corrado Malanga from the University of Pisa in Italy and Filippo Biondi from the University of Strathclyde in Scotland. Announced at a presentation that they had found something incredible under the pyramids of Giza using the latest radar technology, a huge underground network that they say is 10 times larger than the pyramids themselves, the two researchers used a special method called SAR technology, short for Synthetic Aperture Radar. This involves analyzing radar waves reflected from the Earth to create three-dimensional images of the underground. According to Biondi, this data was then used to reconstruct what is under the desert sand, and indeed, without having to dig a single centimeter. And what exactly do the researchers claim to have discovered, Biondi explains. The images show eight cylindrical structures that we have identified as shafts. They are arranged in two parallel rows and surrounded by descending spiral passages. We found them under each of the three pyramids and they appear to serve as access points to this underground system. That sounds impressive at first. The supposed shafts are said to reach about 650 meters deep and the entire network is supposed to extend over several kilometers. For comparison, the Great Pyramid of Giza is just 146 meters high. So here, supposedly, an underground city exists that completely dwarfs the visible structures. In a press release, the results were euphorically described as groundbreaking. If the discovery is accurate, it could rewrite the history of ancient Egypt. That all sounds fantastic, maybe too fantastic. Because before we throw all our history books into the trash, we should perhaps ask ourselves whether these spectacular claims have any substance. And there are, let's say, a few inconsistencies. First of all, it is noticeable that the study has not yet been published in a scientific journal. This is always a bit suspicious, because normally such sensational finds are only announced after they have withstood the critical scrutiny of other experts, the so-called peer review process. But let's not be guided by prejudice. Much more important is the question of whether the technology used is even capable of detecting such deep structures. And here, independent experts express significant doubts. Professor Lawrence Conyers, a recognized radar specialist at the University of Denver, points out, With this SAR technology, it is simply not possible to penetrate that deep into the ground. He considers the idea of an underground city to be a great exaggeration. However, he concedes that it is quite conceivable that smaller structures such as shafts, caves, or chambers could exist beneath the pyramids. What Cognos is addressing here is a fundamental problem of radar technology. The deeper the signals penetrate into the ground, the weaker they become. And 650 meters is a depth that is far beyond what current radar technology could achieve. Scientific skepticism is therefore quite appropriate. But what do we actually know about what might be beneath the pyramids? Is there perhaps some truth to the story after all? In fact, it is not the first time that researchers have encountered mysterious structures beneath the Giza Plateau. In 2017, an international team of researchers discovered a previously unknown cavity in the Great Pyramid using muons, which are particles from cosmic radiation. 
This research, known as the Scanned Pyramids Project, was published in the prestigious journal Nature and was recognized by the scientific community. The cavity discovered was about 30 meters long and had a cross-section similar to that of the Great Gallery inside the pyramid. And just last year, a team of Japanese and Egyptian scientists discovered a mysterious L-shaped structure under the King's Cemetery at least several meters long and filled with sand. This discovery was made using electrical resistivity tomography, a method that is significantly more reliable than the technique claimed by Malanga and Bayondi. The leading professor Motoyuki Sato from Tohoku University in Japan commented on the discovery, This could be part of an artificial structure because this L-shape would not be created by natural geological processes while we hope to find something we did not expect to find it there. This structure could be a kind of entrance to a temple that has not yet been uncovered, a burial chamber or a ritual room. And these confirmed finds show that the Giza Plateau certainly holds secrets, but we are far from a gigantic underground city. Regarding the current case, one question remains unanswered. And if the researchers have indeed made such a sensational discovery, why haven't they published their methods and results in a scientific journal where they could be reviewed by other experts? Instead, they went directly to the public, an approach that is rather unusual. Professor Konyas notes, the only way to prove the accuracy and full extent of the find would be targeted excavations, which would have to be approved by the Egyptian government. And he hits the nail on the head with that because ultimately only actual excavations and physical evidence can confirm the truth of such extraordinary claims. As tempting as the idea of a hidden city beneath the pyramids may be, it is likely a combination of misinterpretation of radar data and a bit too much imagination. The scientific method teaches us that extraordinary claims also require extraordinary evidence. And in this case, they are completely lacking so far. Besides, such gigantic structures would have been noticed in the past, such as the L-shaped structure discovered by Professor Sato. The team had examined the underground with various scanning methods, including ground-penetrating radar and electrical resistance tomography between 2021 and 2023, Aya, for two years. And is it really supposed that a city the size of a kilometer has remained hidden there? Very, very unlikely. So once again, neither a cursed mummy nor an ancient stargate. What a pity, really. If, contrary to expectations, it turns out that an underground megalopolis is actually slumbering under the desert sands of Egypt, it would, of course, be an unparalleled archaeological sensation. But for now, a healthy dose of skepticism is in order. Let me know what you think. I would say that the history of the pyramids is fascinating enough without underground cities. These structures bear witness to the incredible ingenuity, technical brilliance, and cultural wealth of the ancient Egyptians. And serious discoveries, such as those made by Professor Sato and his team, show that there are indeed secrets to be revealed. Stay updated on all the new discoveries about the pyramids, so don't forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the bell so you don't miss anything. And now we travel from Egypt to Australia. Because there too, scientists have found a mysterious ancient structure underground. And this structure sheds a whole new light on the history of our entire planet. Perhaps even the origin of life itself, truly mind-blowing history. You can find out more about it in the video in the top right-hand corner. Be sure to take a look, it's very exciting. And if that doesn't interest you, then maybe the video in the bottom right-hand corner that the algorithm has selected for you. Otherwise, I'd say see you in the next video. Take care, guys.